Let's talk about Louisville mayor's race. Mayor Greg Fisher has now won his third and final term as mayor, defeating the former Metro Councilman Angela Leet by a huge margin. But she was still able to pull a respectable 105,000 votes tonight. Lots of votes coming in for her. Let's take a look at the results. Right now, Greg Fisher 61% with 177,000 votes and Angelique coming in just over that 100,000 mark with 105,037 percent of the vote. Now WHS 11's Rob Harris and our Dennis Tang are both covering the mayor and Angela Leet's campaigns and bringing us reaction from both of them. The election results were slower to roll in than expected. That didn't stop folks here at the Democratic Watch Party from feeling confident. In fact, they were calling it a victory party well before the results were coming in. And that confidence was worth it in the end. Mayor Greg Fisher did give a victory speech just around 8.30. I feel humbled, I feel blessed, I feel excited, and I have never been more hopeful about the future of our city. Mayor Fisher took the chance to tout some of the economic achievements he takes credit for in previous years of his leadership. He also promised to continue working to bridge the gap in prosperity between different zip codes in the city. One particularly powerful moment of the speech came when he reflected on the Kroger shooting that took place just a couple weeks ago. He said that there's no room for this kind of pain in our city. We are one city with one future. We refuse to live in fear or isolation. We refuse to give in or excuse racism, hatred, or prejudice. Fisher also took the chance to thank Angela Lee and his opponent, saying that he appreciates anyone who steps up and offers themselves for public service. Lee herself was holding a watch party elsewhere in Louisville. That's where our reporter Dennis Ting was to get her reaction. Tuesday night began with optimism here at the Republican Party's election center, with many hoping that Councilwoman Angela Leet would be able to upset two-term Mayor Greg Fisher. But by the end of the night, it was a somber atmosphere that ended with a concession speech. Despite her loss, Leet urged her supporters to continue their efforts on bringing change to Louisville, especially when it comes to lowering crime and increasing economic opportunity. Leet also says while it appears voters want to keep the status quo by keeping Fisher in office, she will continue to fight to make changes to better Louisville. We were going to make a stand in this race and provide a voice and challenge the status quo of Louisville, Kentucky. And we're not going to stop challenging that status quo tonight. It does not end here. In her speech, she also mentioned congratulating Mayor Fisher on his victory, telling her supporters they will need to put aside their differences to work together for every Louisvillian, but urged her supporters to continue putting pressure on their leaders to create the change they want to see. Now, when we asked Leet what her plans are after the election, she says that she compared it to a mother who just had a child, saying that she needs some time off to take a break. But she also said that she isn't done fighting. In Louisville, Dennis Ting, WHAS 11 News.